everyone! Today I'm going to be demonstrating how to tie a half hitch knot. A half hitch knot is essentially an overhand knot with the working end brought over and under the standing part. So first you're going to take your rope and make a U shape around the item that you want to tie your half hitch on. You're going to take your working end and put it over your standing end to create an X shape. Then you're going to take this end and put it under this rope right here. And then you're going to pull tight. And make sure that your working end lays on top of your standing end. Just like that. So that is your half hitch knot. This knot is quite insecure by itself, but it forms the base of many other reliable knots. For example, the square knot, the cleat hitch knot, the clove hitch knot, cow knot, timber knot, and the rolling hitch knot. We're gonna be learning about most of these in class, so it's important to be able to correctly do a half hitch so that you can build off of it in the future. Besides that, half hitch knots can be used for fly tying and fly fishing, making paracord survival bracelets, jewelry making and beading, a way to tie sutures and surgery, crochet weight weaving, and more. It is very versatile. When in the field, this knot would typically never be used by itself because it is unstable and mainly acts as a supporting role for other knots. For example, two half hitches, which is much more sturdy, can be used to tie a rope to a tree, a boat, or other objects. And this is your half hitch.